Hey First Engineers, in your 2009 First Competition Kits, you have two of US Digital's E4Ps. These encoders are a perfect fit for many of your robotic applications. Our talent at US Digital is motion control components. We make these products right here in our Vancouver, Washington facility. Let's take a look at your E4P kits. You should have received a spacer tool, two hub disc assemblies, two baseboard assemblies, two covers, and a cable connector. Encoders are the first step in a closed loop system. A closed loop system requires some sort of sensory input or feedback to loop to the device that is providing the power. Let's take a look at an example of a closed loop system. Here's a great example of a closed loop system. It's an electric self-balancing unicycle by Focus Designs. It uses an inclinometer in the control box to detect gravity. The processor uses that information to know which way to rotate the wheel and how fast, thus balancing your unicycle. It does this calculation 640 times per second. Without the gravity sensor, there wouldn't be any way of knowing which angle the unicycle was at. It would be impossible to balance on its own. With your E4P, you have the ability to control your motor with direct feedback. The E4P has a reflective style sensory system that outputs in quadrature format. To begin, there's an LED that shines a collimated light source onto the hub disk assembly. Lines of light reflect back to the module and are detected by many photoelectric diodes. These diodes are set up in some unique patterns and output two different channels, the A channel and the B channel. These channels are set up one quarter of a cycle from each other, giving you the ability to determine direction, how fast you're spinning, and the distance you've traveled. This is quadrature format. The hardware on your board can now decode with four times the precision by monitoring the edges of the pulse instead of the pulse itself. Another example of a feedback loop that uses a separate encoder but the same exact concept is this putting demonstration that we've prepared for you. Using a motor driver, you provide the input and the motor driver reads each count of rotation and drives the motor according to your movement. Do you see the degree of accuracy that you can have here? At US Digital, we realize that you are the experts at your systems, and we're the experts at motion control. Contact us if you have any questions at all regarding your E4Ps. We're here to help you.